Bradley and today are going to be doing a tutorial on how to upgrade your MacBook Pro RAM. This is for the 2009 unibody models with the removable batteries. To start off with you're obviously going to need your MacBook as well as your new RAM. I've chosen two 2 gigabyte sticks um, from Crucial. This is a memory module kit. Um, if you go on their website, I'll put the link in the sidebar. They do offer some good RAM. It's high quality and it's not too expensive. So it's probably one of the best you'll find around. As well as that, you're going to need a Phillips screwdriver. Um, before you start, obviously you need to remove the static. So if you don't have an anti-static wristband, you just want to touch a radiator or something like that. Okay, it's quite easy, so there really is no need to get a professional to do this for you. Um, what you need to do is turn your MacBook over. Flick up your latch and remove the back bottom here and put that to one side. And you've got your battery and your hard drive. You just need to move those by putting up the tabs and put those to the side as well. Now for the hard drive, it has a little screw on it just to hold it in place, so you want to unscrew that. Now, uh, I've obviously put something on the table just to protect my MacBook as well, but it's good to put the screws exactly where you take them out from, just so you remember where they go, as some of them are different sizes. Then you want to pull out your hard drive and take off the little black bracket there. And now you need to remove some more screws. There's four along the top here, as well as four along the bottom where you just remove your battery and your hard drive, so you want to take those out too. Okay, then the same for the bonds at the bottom here. Okay, now you want to remove the back of the laptop like that. And there's the inside of your MacBook. The RAM, as you can see, is here. I'll just open up the new one, I'll take it out of its packet. It's quite just simply two sticks of two gigabyte RAM. So I'll take those out of the plastic and put them to one side. Okay, now you need to remove the old RAM. Basically, there's just two latches that you'll find here. Pull them apart and the RAM should just flick up like that and then you put it out at a slight angle. Take it out by the sides just so you don't damage it and then put it to the side. And then the same for the bottom, pull the latches apart again and slide it out. Like so. And now we need to put the new ones in. Basically the same, you want to pick them up by the sides and you basically want to put them in at an angle like that and then push them downwards into the slot so it clicks into place and then it's in same for the second one and put that directly on top push it in at an angle and then push it down and then you should hear the two latches click into place and that's how you know it's secure so it should be firm in place okay and now what we need to do is basically just put everything back together so the back goes on top like so replace all your screws Okay, now you need to replace the hard drive. Simply screw it in the bracket, put it into the black bracket. And then screw it in this bracket. Replace the battery. and the back and then you're done
just send it back over and then if it turns on it's a success so let's see And once it's loaded, you can check that it's the correct RAM by going to the Apple symbol about this Mac. And then you can see there, it's 4 gigabytes of DDR3 RAM. That's all for this video. I'll put all the details if you want to get yourself some RAM to upgrade in the sidebar. Um, if you like it, don't forget to rate, subscribe, and comment below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.